from calling her ex out for controlling her decisions to be a mother to landing the second highest book deal in history. The Britney Spears memoir is all set to unleash on Justin Timberlake. And let's just say he's terrified. Hold on to your seats because the tea I'm about to spill will leave you shook. The princess of pop, the legend, the icon, Ms. Britney Spears has just dropped a bombshell that no one saw coming. For those of you who don't know, the pop diva is all set to release her memoir titled The Woman in Me. And boy, has the book promised to be a wild ride. The first topic of discussion, her very iconic relationship with one of the biggest pop stars in the world, none other than Justin Timberlake. Everyone remembers what an iconic power couple these two were back in the 2000s. Denim on denim, pop royalty, a match made in Hollywood heaven. But behind those dazzling smiles and the glitz and glam, one story remained untold until now. Back then, Britney was young and deeply in love with the NSYNC heartthrob. Their love story was what pop dreams were made of, but there was more to it than just that because for a brief moment, there was a possibility the two of them having a baby together. That's right, while they were dating, Britney was actually pregnant with Justin Timberlake's baby. But hold the congratulations, because spoiler alert, this story takes a heart-wrenching turn. According to Britney's tell-all book, she was over the moon for her bundle of joy with the man she loved. But surprise, surprise, she claims that JT wasn't exactly jumping for joy. In fact, he thought they were too young and just not ready to be responsible for another life. Brittany, on the other hand, reveals that for her, the surprise pregnancy wasn't a tragedy. A shock, yes, but the iconic star was ready to build a life and family with Justin. And that's not where she stopped. Britney claimed that if she was the only one making the decision, she would have definitely had the baby. But since the father didn't want that to happen, she had to make the tough call of not going ahead with the pregnancy. If that doesn't show you that Justin and Britney's love story wasn't exactly the fairy tale that the world thought it was, I don't know what does. While Britney agreed to get an abortion, it's a decision that stayed with her, haunting her memory, which is part of the reason why her and Justin ultimately decided to part ways. That's not the only heartbreaking thing though. In The Woman in Me, Britney gets real. She's laying it all out, showing you a side to the pop princess the world has never seen, raised in a home where abortion was a no-no. Due to family and religious beliefs, Brittany was completely lost when she found out she had to make the hard decision. Thankfully though, she was able to move on from the situation and went on to welcome her two sons, Sean Preston and Jaden James, becoming the mother she always knew she wanted to be. But of course, with this new memoir, she's definitely digging up some skeletons from her closet and it looks like Justin isn't too happy about it. Now, sources from Entertainment Tonight are spilling that Timberlake is unbothered focusing on his family and seemingly brushing off the impending storm that Britney's memoir is sure to stir up. A baby? Abortions? That's a whole can of worms JT is not ready to open, not publicly at least. A source claims he's been rooting for Britney, but from the sidelines. After all, he has his own partner to think about, right? As for Jessica Biel, Mrs. Timberlake is evidently standing by her man and together they're looking to move ahead instead of looking back. But guess what? Whether he likes it or not, Britney's not afraid to let the world know what Justin really was like. Because after the pregnancy bombshell, the pop star also revealed that Justin cheated on her with another woman. Yikes, who could have seen this one coming? The truth is that as iconic as their relationship was, things pretty much came crashing down when these two pop icons broke up. I mean, remember JT's iconic and shady music video for Cry Me A River? Yeah, the one that had a Britney lookalike and a story of betrayal that had everyone and their grandma convinced that Ms. Spears played the infidelity card. But hold up, cause neither of them actually spilled the real tea. JT kept it cryptic and Britney, radio silence until now. 
And this girl's ready to turn the tables because she's straight up accusing Justin of being a cheater. You have to give it to Brittany though, because she refuses to name the woman he was cheating on her with. But her former flame isn't the only one Brittany's exposing. After all that conservatorship drama, her dad is in the line of fire once again, and for all the right reasons. In a recent sit down with People, she's pointing fingers directly at her dad, accusing him of making her life a living hell for 13 long years. In her upcoming memoir, Brittany is not holding back. She claims her father didn't just control her money and career, but went as low as belittling and degrading her. Yup, Daddy Spears allegedly had her feeling like a robot program to perform, sing, and dance with no say in her own life. From her assets to her career moves and even reproductive rights, the young girl couldn't make any decisions for herself. Brittany isn't afraid to let the world know that she didn't deserve what her family did to her, using her as nothing but a way for them to make money. She gets super real about being constantly watched and criticized, which naturally made her act out. Remember Brittany shaving her head back in the day? It was her massive middle finger to everyone who wouldn't stop criticizing her every move. But enter her dad in the conservatorship and boom, she's forced back into that box, no rebellion allowed. And it wasn't just about making pop hits, it was about controlling Britney in every possible way. The princess of pop is also peeling back the layers and taking you down memory lane. Rewinding to the days before, the world knew her as Britney Spears, pop icon. She was just a girl, a Mickey Mouse Club member, sharing kisses with Justin Timberlake and sipping daiquiris with her mom. She spills that drinking with her mom wasn't like when her dad hit the bottle. It was a time of joy and bonding, a stark contrast to the shadow that loomed when her father drank. But wait, there's more. Remember the iconic MTV Music Awards performance with the giant snake? Turns out Britney was scared to death wrapped in that massive reptile. A pop spectacle to the world, but truly a moment that made her wonder whether all of this was really worth it. And because she thinks that throughout her life, her story has always been told for her. Brit's here to take back her power with her memoir. In her own words to people, it's time to cut through the noise. No intermediaries, no censored narratives, just Brittany, unfiltered and unscripted. And hey, I'm all for it. After all this, if you're dying to get your hands on a copy of Brittany's tell-all memoir, it hits the stores on October 24th, 2023, and is all set to cover the events before and after the pop singer was released from her 13-year conservatorship. But here's some good news. The pop star was reportedly paid $15 million for her memoir, making this one of the highest earning book deals in history, right next to Barack and Michelle Obama. But what's even cooler is that Britney's memoir will also be released in the form of an audiobook voiced by none other than the Oscar-nominated powerhouse, Michelle Williams, who isn't just lending her voice to the book, she's standing in solidarity with her. Brittany spilling that diving back into her past for this memoir has been all kinds of an emotional roller coaster. Exciting? Check. Heart-wrenching? Double check. So intense that Brittany herself is only reading a small part of it. So mark your calendars, folks. Because the woman in me isn't just hitting the shelves. It's about to shake the very foundations of the pop world as you know it.